and welcome to my birthday weekend vlog. It's May long weekend. My birthday's on the 24th, so it's Monday of the May long weekend. In Canada, it is Victoria Day, and I had to get up early and get ready because we are getting our hot water tank replaced today. So somebody is coming in about 30 minutes. I got ready pretty fast. So somebody's coming in like 30 minutes to replace our hot water tank. Luckily, this happened last night where the hot water tank basically was like spewing water out and our water wasn't hot and they're able to come replace it the next day, which is good. So we didn't really have a long period of time without hot water. Basically, I just couldn't have a shower this morning, but I can have one later today. So not too bad. So all the restaurants are closed, so we can't go out for dinner, which would usually be my choice for my birthday, just so that I didn't have to cook or clean or anything. So what I decided I wanted to do was I wanted to make like an entire Greek dinner, but from scratch. So I made Slovaki seasoning. Then I have pork and chicken. So I have like chicken on skewers and then just pork chops marinating in a bag of the Slovaki stuff that I made. I made like a seasoning and then mixed it with olive oil and lemon juice. Those have been marinating in the fridge. And then right now I'm gonna make tzatziki, which I've never made before, pita bread, which I've never made before. And I'm gonna cut up some veggies. We're gonna have Caesar salad. I know we should probably be having Greek salad, but I don't really love Greek salad because I don't really like olives or tomatoes. And then, yeah, we're also going to look at one more wedding venue today. Chris has his vaccine today. Hot water tank. Oh, I'm also watching a wedding at 12 today. A friend is getting married and so I'm watching the live stream at 12. Oh, and I'm also making a cake today, but not for myself, for my boss actually has the same birthday as me. So I am making a cake for her, but I'm making it, I'm gonna bake the cake today, decorate tomorrow and then hand it off tomorrow. And then I don't have to actually make a cake on my actual birthday for somebody else, but I really wanted to make her a cake. So I was fine with making a cake on my birthday weekend for somebody else. <laughs> so I'm gonna make my tzatziki first. The recipe says to make it like early, like even like the day before, because it tastes better when the ingredients like sit together. So I apparently actually should have made it yesterday, but that's good. I'm gonna start with the cucumber. It says you want your cucumber to be really dry. Grate the cucumber, slice it half lengthways, and scoop out the seeds. Okay, so I think I need to, I grated it and cut it in half, and then I think I have to get rid of the seeds. because that's where all the water is apparently. And then I think I grate with like a cheese grater into a bowl with paper towels so that I can squeeze out the juice. Okay, so I think I go like this and then grate my cucumber into there and then squeeze out all the juice. squeeze all the water out of it. It's a surprising amount of water in cucumbers. I need more paper towel. Okay, now I think I just add the other ingredients. Two cups of plain Greek yogurt. So I just got this. I don't really know much about Greek yogurt to be honest. This container is exactly two cups, pretty much. Okay, then we need one tablespoon of lemon juice, one tablespoon of dill. That's a lot of dill. Um, one and a half teaspoons of oregano. and two cloves of minced garlic. We really like garlic, I might go a little crazy on that. 
Okay, I'm gonna mix this up. And then it says drizzle with olive oil and garnish with additional dill. So I think I will wait to do that. I'll just cover this and throw it in the fridge. Okay, and next up I'm gonna make pita bread because it needs two to three hours to rise. So I gotta get going on this. The hot water tank guy is supposed to be here right now as well. So I might just actually wait till he gets here. All I need is it yeast, warm water, flour, sugar, salt, olive oil. So pretty standard, just bread recipe. But and then this is my chicken skewers marinating and this is pork um, marinating in the Slovakia that I made. Okay, I just taste tested it, my tzatziki. It tastes really good. And we got, these are going to be my pita breads. I have to let them rise for a few more minutes. Okay, now I'm cooking them in the pan. I'm just going to, ooh, that's like a little oily. I may have put too much olive oil. And here I'm just getting my little discs and using the rolling pin to flatten them. We have an appointment at two to go look at a wedding venue. So we need to leave in like 15 minutes. So I may have done this at a bad time, but I was making chocolate cakes. My chocolate cakes are made and in the freezer that I needed to do. And I watched a wedding live stream. And then now I gotta do this. And then we'll go check out a wedding venue. It turned out so good. I tried a piece, that's why there's a piece missing, but it's delicious. Fire in the barbecue up, it smells. I love the smell when you turn the barbecue on. And I'm doing veggies. And those are a little ways out still. Yeah. Verdict, I'm very full and it was delicious. What's your rating? <laughs> <Maybe tripped>. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I fell down the stairs today too, Pepe. You and Pepe are both going to be I'm full. I heard my birthday cake. <laughs> birthday rice cake. Am I just putting one candle? Well, I'm 29. There's no way I'm getting 29 candles on this. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday. Okay. Go sit down. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Santa. Happy birthday to you. Wow. And many more. Did you make this yourself? I did. No way. No boyfriends. You have one boyfriend. No one fiance. Oh, yeah, no boyfriends, you're right. <laughs>